Welcome, this is the NC Bad Boys. I'm Duncan McCarty. I'm Cole McGuire. I'm Sam Fisher. And we're the NC Bad Boys. Last night, Daniela was sent home. He's struggling to cope with it. It's okay, Doug. It'll be okay, man. Thanks. Thanks. You know, some other stuff happened, too. And just because I'm sad, I don't want you guys to miss out on what the action of what happened. Don't want our viewers to be let down and uninformed. So although I'm in a little bit of a sad state, we're going to go ahead and give you the information anyways, all right? So we're going to, let's start it off talking about the uh, group date they had. Oh yeah. No, actually, yeah, actually, actually let me, let, let me actually just start it with the fact that Taylor, uh, the, it's the episode started with, she was talking to Nick and she actually got sent home again. So she's been sent home twice in one she's season crazy. of The Bachelor. Yeah, she's so. crazy. That's, That's two L's. I didn't think Tay exactly right. Yep, I didn't. Tay Lola, two L's, two L's, two L's. Yep. All, All right, right and the group do. date. Yeah. So, <laughs> two people were sent home on the group date. How about what else happened on the group date, Sam? Uh, well, they were played a whole bunch of volleyball. Sure and, did. You know, as was assumed, they they weren't very athletic, so. And it was very emotional. It was kind of yeah. terrible yeah. game. Who was crying again? All of them. All, like, all yeah. cried. Every all single girl. Whole... Jasmine was crying the most, though, yeah. because she didn't get the one on one with Nick at the beginning of the episode. And Nick getting that attention. And oh, shut up. She just wouldn't stop crying yeah. the entire episode. But yeah, good thing, day, good they thing all she went home. home. You can see Jasmine arrow to her house because Sayonara, she's going home. Yeah, I'm glad. Light when she was little. Just oh, Christina. 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 Yeah, Christina. All right. All right. So, Christina. She opens up New Horizons to Nick, and I think it's going to put her forward really far. They had definitely developed a connection off of the personal information that she revealed. Yeah, she to uh, Nick. she told him that when she, in, uh, from Russia when she was little that her family didn't have any money, and so what she have to eat? They couldn't get food, so they had to eat lipstick. Lipstick. She had to eat That's, lipstick. I mean, she grew up terrible. through all these hardships, and this is what the bash was really all about. I mean. Great story. You no, know, honestly, she, I do have a question though. If she can't afford food, how could she afford lipstick? But that's, maybe it. that's they, a question for a different. Maybe time. they just found it on the streets or something. Maybe. Right. So let's, let's just see. Oh, let's we got to talk about how Grin. Um, oh, what she said. How the house cleaners and what she said. No, we're gonna talk about that at the end. All right. So we're talking about Corinne. She used um, a not North Central Live appropriate term, but she started by saying, yeah. "My heart is golden." But my inappropriate word is platinum, and it's just strange. I mean, who says that? Who? How would you even think about that? I don't like, even know. Who comes up with stuff like that? Strange <laughs> people. <laughs> strange people. So then up here we have we've came to a conclusion of the Bachelor so far that eleven x cubed cosine Quran one one radical two x my all of this equals rigged. I mean, ABC has rigged the show. How? Yeah. They freaking found out it. that Corinne. One, how is Corinne still on it? Yeah. How did Whitney make it this far? Person. How did Jasmine make it this far? How is Danielle at home? She's yeah. one of the most beautiful girls to ever be yeah. on The Bachelor. How does Danielle go home the how? same time that Jasmine goes home? And then ABC. Here, you can tell them about this, Sam. What did they do? Basically, ABC sent a housekeeper for the girls. AKA for Kareem. They sent it for Kareem so she could make sure that her living conditions were the best they could be. Rigged. That's just not called for. How the producers want Kareem to win. It's, yeah. She probably paid him out. She probably did. Actually, probably not, but. There's a lot. All right, so this episode raised more questions than answers. Um, definitely next week's going to be a huge episode i mean it left you with a lot of questions kind of just like a, a jaw-dropping episode like what just happened yeah so this episode may have been a little confusing we're still a little kind of mind boggled. i mean you there's know, obviously some yeah. stuff going yeah, on yeah and you know what i rig. really didn't understand was the girls at the end of the episode that were still left were nervous because they thought nick was going to quit because he was so disappointed well i mean that's not how a contract works but he can't really just quit on a TV show that yeah. he signed a contract. He literally with, has so. ten girls just doing whatever they can to please him. And you know why, why I think the girls were shocked? Quit? Because of Danielle. When she went I home, know. I think the girls oh, were yeah, like, maybe. "Well, if she went home, then who does he like?" If a girl that looks like that could go home, I'm any girl could go home. Yeah, that's what they're thinking. 
Um, update on the week. Uh, right now, Cole's in first place on the Bachelor Fantasy League. I'm in second, and Sam still has zero points. In last. Actually, I do have 20 points. So. Since when? Since we said that in the first episode that I had 20 points. No, we said yeah. you had zero. No, You've always said zero. You have had You guys zero. lied because you didn't. You wanted to make it seem like I was actually doing it. No, me and Duncan were tied for 30 for a while, but then... You always had zero. He stepped ahead, took the lead, yeah. It's a lie, actually. They're lying, but it's okay. Dang. Oh, thanks for tuning in this episode. Thanks. Thanks for tuning in, guys. <laughs>